I looked into Putin's eyes and I see three letters, a K, a G, and a B. He's an old KGB apparatchik surrounded by his buddies who were in the KGB, and he's not going to restore the power and prestige of the Soviet Union, but he is trying to restore the Russian Empire, and he enjoys sticking his thumb in our eye. And we just, he's not going to, we're not going to see a reignition of the Cold War. But when we try to make progress on Iran, he's going to, he's going to block it. I mean, duh, we've figured it out. How would you handle the relationship with Putin? I would, uh, I don't know if it would work, but I might disinvite him to the next G8 meeting. Um, these countries in the G8 are supposed to have common economic principles and values. He's basically turning every industry and every enterprise into a state-run organization, i.e. he and his cronies are dividing up the, the dividend. If it wasn't for oil, Putin's, uh, the Russian economy would be in the tank. They've got aging problem, they've got AIDS problem, they've got e every kind of difficulty. Our friend Dr. Kissinger, I'm sure you admire greatly, once said, that was a joke, uh, that, uh, uh, once said, said, Russia without Ukraine is an Eastern power, with Ukraine is a Western power. I think that's very true. When you look at what used to be the Soviet Union and, 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 and what it is now. So, I, as I said, I don't see a reignition of the Cold War and I, you know, nuclear, uh, you know, all of that kind of stuff, although nuclear weapons, we still need to continue the non-Luger uh, program. And, and I'm sorry for the long answer, but uh, I, I, would, I, I would not invite him to, my, to Sedona. I really wouldn't. I wouldn't in, invite him to our place in Sedona. I would talk with him. I would work on programs that are helpful, such as a non-Luger program. I would find areas where we can work together. But I would recognize him for what he is. He's, a, he's an individual who wants all power and, cons and consolidate it with himself and his friends. And what he's going through right now that I predicted a long time ago, I predicted a long time ago he'd never give up power. He'll either make himself the president again or he will have one of his stooges, somebody that you and I never heard of in our lives, as as the uh, as the next president so he can run everything well that's not good for the russian people